What's up everyone, Mission Nostalgia here once again and thank you for joining me on yet another review video. So we all know that Nintendo is one of the biggest and most successful video game companies in the world, right? But the real question is, does anyone know what Nintendo was doing before entering the video game business? So today we are going to have a look at the early days of Nintendo and we are going to get some very useful information from this book right here. So this book is called Before Mario, the fantastic toys from the video game giant's early days, written by Eric Voskul and published by Omake Books. The period from 1965 to 1983 was a pivotal time for Nintendo, during which it transformed from manufacture of traditional playing cards into a key player in the area of electronic entertainment. Before Mario provides a rich illustrated overview of over 15 Nintendo toys and games that are representative of these formative years. As you can see, the text is also written in French, Actually, the entire book is written in both languages, so with just one copy you get everything, both in English and in French. So Nintendo was founded in 1989 and for the first 75 years it was producing playing cards for the local market. During the 60s, the company expanded its product line into toys, board games and later into arcade games and finally video games and consoles. So this book is basically a collection of products manufactured by Nintendo from the mid-60s to the early 80s and are taken from Eric Voskul's personal collection. For every item you can find a number of high-quality photographs, a short description, the date it was released and its introductory price. Trust me guys, you wouldn't believe the variety of products you will find in this book. From baseball and roulette games to love testers and electronic congas with which you could actually play and record music. Some items did not even cross the Japanese borders, so unless you or somebody else had bought them from Japan, there would be no other way to find them. Ok guys, I have to show you this one because it's really amazing. A cotton candy machine. No, I really mean it, a cotton candy machine. Making cotton candy. Developed by Nintendo. In 1970. How cool is that? I mean, imagine a 70s kid saying to another, Oh, my father bought me a cotton candy machine from this toy company called Nintendo. Doesn't it sound crazy? Well, it wasn't crazy back in the 70s. Apart from the products themselves, the book also contains other useful information. It starts with a foreword by Nintendo longtime developer Satoru Okada and an introduction by Eric Voskel himself. It also includes an interview with the author, timelines of the history of Nintendo and many, many, many more. So if you are a collector or a Nintendo fan, or you just want to find out what Nintendo was producing back in the day, I definitely encourage you to check out this book. Eric Voskli has done some pretty amazing job with this one and the result will definitely not disappoint you. So that's it for today guys, thank you so much for sticking around until the end of this video. If you liked it, hit the like and subscribe buttons, leave a comment down below to tell me what you think, and of course check out my other videos right here. Thank you all and I'll see you in the next video, bye.